a cute little affordable style by Tressalore. Let's revisit Charlotte today in a beautiful brunette. Charlotte is a cute little shag style cut with lots of volume and curl. It has some straight and some curly pieces that give it a lot of interest. And this is such an affordable style. Just a wonderful everyday wig style. I have reviewed this one several times in some other colors. Remember, you can find and purchase this one at Wig Studio One if you go below the video and expand the description box. I'll attach a direct product link in there. If you click on the link, it'll take you out to the site. You can see all of the colors, pricing, and details. Add it to your cart and purchase if you like. Please reach out if you have any questions to support at wigstudio1.com. Some form of shag style cut is always in fashion. I think it's so flattering around the face and it's a very youthful look as well with all the layering. Now Charlotte has a six and a half inch fringe piece and that fringe is a little bit straighter because it's more manageable around the face than if it were curly. And the curl kind of starts at the crown and works its way through the back there's a six and a half inch crown and a three inch nape. And that nape is ample to cover up, I would guess, any natural hairline. And at just over two ounces, it's a really lightweight style featuring a machine made cap, open wefts throughout. There is some permatease on this style, as you would expect, mostly to sustain some of this bigger volume. There's no lace front, there's no monofilament that helps keep the price down. Plus you have all this beautiful coverage. You really don't need those features for this to be a wonderful plug and chug, throw and go everyday wig style. This is called Cola Swirl. And this is a combination of some medium to dark brown and then there's some medium auburn and then you're gonna find a kind of a honey blonde highlight in there as well. You can see those blonde highlights really stand out against this dark backdrop. So this is a really very neutral color. Um, I find that the dark pieces of the brown are more, more cool. Uh, the auburn is going to warm it up a little bit and the honey is fairly neutral within itself. So even though there's some auburn in this, this is not your typical red. There's definitely no copper tones in it. So let's talk permatease for a moment. There is a lot of permatease on this style all throughout it, on the top, sides, and back to sustain this soft, voluminous look. Um, however, if you wanted to tamp it down, I think you could definitely get a slimmer profile on this as well. You can part it wherever you like. So even though there's a six and a half inch piece off of the front, these are no more than four inches, these little bangs. A little eyelash bang here. So what I've noticed with this Charlotte as opposed to some that I have owned in the past, it's very large. I am definitely not going to be able to keep this one because it is so large. The crisscross, I crisscross the adjusters, it causes a little bit of gapping in the back. There's a ton of empty loose baggy cap up there. So if you have bio hair or if you have a larger circumference, I think this is a style that would suit you very well. The fiber is not heat friendly, it's just regular synthetic fiber. Each one is a very fine, baby fine, silky type fiber. So again, just adding to that lightweight feeling and appeal. So you can definitely get volume without weighing it down. I always found Charlotte to work really well with my glasses. There's really no permatease right there above the ear tab, so it works well. And it's a very light density right there too. Beautiful, safe, secure glasses. Friendly style. So let's go ahead and I'll just move it around so you can get a sense of it and catch some of my earlier videos on this if you are a blonde lover that'll give you an idea of some blondes with this style everybody have a great day see you soon right back here at Taz's wig closet